what we're going to do is we're going to make ourselves a calming menu. You know, we've been reading some of these books lately, like Fergal and the Bad Temper, and how he's figuring out ways to calm down when he gets upset. And how, do you remember how the animals all calm down different ways? So when he learns how other people are calming down, he realizes, so his mom tells him that she calms down by counting to ten, and Crow calms down by talking to his friends, telling them all about it. Fox calms down by watching the sunset. Wolf goes and makes a big noise somewhere by himself. Rabbit runs around and runs around and runs around and goes outside and gets his energy out. Cat likes to lay down and stretch. And he finds his ways to calm down too. And everyone has their different ways. And I don't know if you remember when the mouse was mad, but there's a bunch of different ways to calm down in this one. I want to see. So, Bear calms down by stomping. This one is Bobcat. He calms down by going and screaming. <laughs> and Hedgehog calms down by making a perfect circle with his body. But Mouse can't do any of these things. So what Mouse does is he stands still and he breathes. And that's how he calms down. So I thought we could think about the ways that maybe help you calm down and we can make a menu of things for when you're feeling upset. Can I tell you some of the things that I've noticed that you do when you're mad? What? I've noticed that one of the things you do is you go into your room by yourself. Does that help you? Well, you how about I write down because it's something that you use often. I'm helping him right now. So, go into my bedroom alone. And you have to draw my bed. I have to draw your bed? Okay. Here's your bed. And you and have to draw got me. the canopy. And you have to draw me, like, okay. on the corner. What? Here's, oh, you like to sit up on the corner? Yeah. Okay. By the window? Yeah, me too. Okay, so go into bedroom alone and look out the window. I don't look out the window, but I okay. usually sit up there. Okay. Let's think about what are some of the ways that you calm down when you're mad. We can make your calming menu. I calm down when I'm at a house. Okay, so one way is to be... So it says Eli's calming menu. So be at home. That's one of your choices. Let me draw a picture of the our house. Oh yeah. Yeah. Is there something else that you do to calm down? Sometimes we suggest that you take deep. I come, I take deep breaths with, with birds. Take deep breaths with birds. Okay. Yeah. So deep breaths with birds. Do here's a picture of Eli, and your mouth is going to be open wide. Taking your deep breaths. And you like it with birds? <laughs> Does it ever help? Well, what are some of the other ways that help you calm down? Taking deep breaths and putting your fingers in the air? Mm-hmm. Okay. So, breathing with fingers in the air. I'm in a book. Okay, hold on. So here, 
through to you. And you're sticking your fingers up in the air. I want to see. And you're taking a deep breath. <laughs> That's me doing it.